صلوا عليه شافي علما Solitude has always played a pivotal role in one's personal and spiritual development. As mentioned, the Prophet ﷺ would regularly retreat in the cave of Hira. It is here in seclusion they receive the first revelation. This tradition of seclusion has been preserved throughout the ages as the act of ittikaf. It is unfortunate to note that many do not reap the benefits and rewards of sitting this tradition of itikaf in the blessed month of Ramadan. That's why Tariqa Muhammadiyah has designed and delivered a unique 10-day itikaf program which has been delivered over the past 15 years in the UK. This year it is the first time that we're delivering this in Pakistan, Qariya Hakika Sharif. Let's have a look inside. Our unique structure to the Ittikaf program consists of eight key elements that a participant can find themselves doing within 24 hours. The first of which is a practical course of self-purification designed by the luminary Sheikh Ahmed Dabbagh here in the Zavia is a training center uh, for self-purification, uh, self-development and self-enlightenment and self-enhancement and also finding the true purpose uh, of life. So basically human being is made of five elements, the spiritual element, the physical element namely the body and the mental element, the mind, and the moral self, which is the heart, and the emotional self, which is the, the, the nafs, all are developed, they have potential to develop. And the program here is designed to develop all of them, begin developing all of them. This flagship personal development course aims to shift a person's life perspective and teaches a person on how to improve themselves and their relationships to achieve closeness with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the Prophet Secondly, a student can find themselves in one of several practical classes delivered by a number of qualified trainers and teachers on topics of self-development and renewing their connection with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Thirdly, a participant can find themselves in a number of practical meditation and muraqaba sessions designed to develop a deep and intimate connection with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through the power of dua. Fourthly, there are a number of circles of discussion and reflection where participants discuss what they have learned and what they can implement practically from the classes. Fifthly, food is prepared locally on site and served by a dedicated team comprising of volunteers who uptake their duty as a matter of their own spiritual development. Both iftar, suhoor and tea breaks are served to all participants on site. A participant can find themselves developing spiritual discipline through the service of others. This could be by serving food, supporting the media team or helping clean facilities. Seventhly, a special majlis of dhikr occurs at the hundred time, aimed to provide a moment of spiritual upliftment and connection at the most blessed time of the night. And finally, a participant can find themselves in the collective prayer of Tarawih, led by a number of Imams and the luminary Sheikh Ahmed Dabbagh. This is conducted throughout the Ittikaf program. We guidance, we didn't get guidance, we didn't get any road. So we were in the middle of the road, we were in the middle of the road, and we were in the middle of the road. We thank God that Allah has come here. So why would you recommend this program? To anybody else to I very strongly recommend, rather I urge all of all of my Muslim brothers and sisters that please must come here to feel the essence of life in this world and life hereafter. If a person takes the right decision and tries to do it, then he gets what he wants. After coming here, I feel that I have experienced the essence of Islam. I have experienced the essence of Islam for the first time.